Hi, it's Jesse here from BoldGrid. I'm here today to answer another question from one of our users. It's one we get a lot. Um, this one is from Brian. Um, Brian says, hi there on my key site pages. I'd like to keep the standard primary header menu across the top. Uh, but with that said, I'm looking to build out several landing pages for marketing campaigns that omit the header and menu altogether. I'm unsure how to get the header off of those pages. Any suggestions would be greatly appreciated. Um, Brian mentions that he's using the Cobalt theme um, with Bullgrid, but what I'm about to say will go for any of the Bullgrid themes. Um, so I've got here just a, a page that I've created in the Post and Page Builder. Um, and so the first thing I'm gonna do um, in order to accomplish this is I'm gonna switch this. I'm gonna move over so you can see what I'm doing here. I'm gonna switch this um, page attributes template to the home template um, and that's going to be your template with no sidebar um, so generally the reason that you're creating a page like this is to avoid anything distracting to get your users out of your sales funnel so no side sidebar no header um, so we'll go ahead and put it on the home template and publish that page and once you either publish it or save a draft up here in the URL you're gonna see the page ID um, it's the number that comes right after post equals. Um, in this example, is going to be 130. Um, for you, it's going to be different. So uh, when you're editing your page, that's going to be your landing page. Just make a note of that post ID um, and then head over to customize your theme. Um, so I'm in the customize, advanced, uh, custom CSS menu here. Um, and we're just going to add one simple rule here. Um, so it is going to be uh, body dot page ID 130 which was that number from before and then hashtag masthead oops spell it correctly um, masthead is the ID of the in, entire header element um, and so from, from there we're just gonna say display colon none semicolon and go ahead and publish that CSS rule And once that's saved, we'll head back over to edit our page and we'll go ahead and view the changes, preview the changes. And so now you can see that the header is gone. Um, we just have the page content here for, um, for your visitors for your marketing campaigns. And um, if you need to add any additional pages that you don't want your header on, um, just add a comma and then do the exact same thing again, body.page-id, and then whatever that number is, hashtag masthead, comma again, if you're gonna add a third page, and so on and so forth. So, um, Brian, I hope that answers your questions. Um, please let us know if you have any more while you're creating your landing pages. We're happy to help.